How's it, folks? Kim's with me. And he's, uh, to be fair, Kim's leading the show at the moment. And um, we've come into something that's pretty cold, eh, bro? Yeah, yeah, real cold. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> and um, we're having a look for, uh, for some tar at the moment. Hopefully see some deer as well. I mean, hopefully see something. Something, yeah. Let's start with that. Yeah, I'm a little bit more focused on tar this weekend. Uh, the weather's playing a bit of a trick on us. It's a, yeah, pushing us higher and higher, but that's okay. We had to get up here eventually. Uh, yeah, we we whipped into the hut last night. Uh, pretty much started our trip as the sun went down, eh? And, uh, mm. and uh, so it's pretty late. Yeah, and yeah. Bit of a late one. And I uh, drove uh, many hours. <laughs> And then, yeah, and then rocketed it into the hut uh, in the dark. So uh, it's a pretty cool the spot. It was, it was nice to be in the hut last night. It got very cold this mm. morning. So, um, but yeah, we yeah we blew straight past the, the hut last night. That was a bit of a laugh. Uh, so yeah, but now we're up here. And we're having a look. We're gonna push, keep pushing on through here. Uh, yeah, so hang around, and see what we do. So um, Cam spotted a tar up on this on this ridge. He was just cruising along, and now he's just setting skyline. Um, the only issue is he's between where we are and where we want to be. So we were just waiting for him to drop over, which he did. We got ready to move, and then <sighs> he's come back over again. So at the moment, we're just playing it cool, getting some photos, and enjoying a bit of sun. A little bit of rest. I'm definitely enjoying some rest. But um yeah, so as soon as he frees up and out of the way we're over there. It's gonna be uh it's been some pretty pretty <laughs> it's been a energetic walk this morning. Uh the snow's sort of like quite icy so we're breaking through a little bit. It's um pretty epic country though. Um, Hopefully we can whip up a bit further and get into this bit. I can see Cam's getting itchy feet. Once that tar had gone onto the other side of that ridge, we quickly made our way across the valley and entered into the bottom of a, a steep snow chute. I was pretty grateful for the fact that Cam was cutting me uh, some convenient steps to climb up. They were at a relatively inconvenient pace though. It was uh, it was tough going. At one stage I think I just told Cam to go and I'd make it there. And once we were up the top, we could get a pretty good view down onto the ridge line that that tar was on. And uh, Cam started to formulate a plan. So Cam began his stalk to get down onto that ridge. What was uh, a little hectic about it all was on the other side of the crest you could see we knew there was a good mob of tar and, and there there was a, a couple of big boys that were pretty interested on but um, we'd, we'd set, some, set some focus on this one on the ridge and, and, and Cam was often into it this is easily one of the most epic things I've seen if not the most epic thing I've seen hunting yet, it was uh, it was hard to capture it all on film because I was pretty in the moment as well. It was uh, it was cool. What I found interesting in all of this was uh, 
how comfortable Tar seemed to be with seeing you at a distance. I mean, we did get to experience the fact that they're quite uncomfortable at seeing you at, at 60 yards. But from a long way away, they just really didn't seem to be that bothered. So that was, uh, that was something new, something that I hadn't quite seen before in the pursuit of deer. sharing a bit of his uh, stalk story it's good to know that you get puffed bro to be honest that was hard yeah <laughs> it was awesome <laughs> that was awesome bro the snow is so freaking annoying now it was fun for the morning <laughs> yeah. pretty shot now haven't had any anything to eat yet like yeah. a music bar so yeah I need to get some food in me yeah uh, those, oh, that was good because I didn't have to break cover into those other bulls for that one. Yeah, this so, time. Yeah, still up there. Bro, that was, it was wicked when you just got up and bolted down and yeah, I was just like, yeah. yo. Yeah, now, now I never, as I popped up, looking perfect, like quartering away shot. Like, um, I think it was about 30 yards. Yeah. And uh, just like, just enough time to get my rangefinder up and nah, not having a bar of that and then stopped at 40. And I was like, oh. And then just jumped off the off the bluff. Yeah, Did you I, see I, it? I I think I missed it on the camera, bro. But it was just like yeah, I sailed just, out. I was just like, what the? Where'd you go? And that is, that's like a, it's a vertical bluff. He just jumped off, landed on a ledge, and then just trotted down. And I was like, oh, this, yeah, bro. That's what we're chasing. Yeah, they're like Batman. Eh? Just bro, it was epic. Just watching him just take off and then just. Phew. Yeah, that's the first time I've seen that. That was cool. Oh. Forty yards. For my first proper stalk on a on a time pretty pretty uh, Bro, it was it was uh pretty awesome to watch. I was just like I oh, actually in this moment I'm just gonna sit here, keep still and do nothing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. As much as I was tempted to like, oh I might do this or I might get that out of my thing, I was just like just fucking stay still, idiot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Especially when I seen him too, I was just like oh. Yeah, bugger. We could have probably just popped up over the top of there and he would have been like five yards away if we continued the way that we were going to go. Ow. That's all right, though. Yeah, that was awesome to watch, bro. Cool. That was awesome to watch. I think uh, I think that was an amazing effort. But what's nice is that those other ones are still over there, right? Eh? Yeah. Could you see them? Yeah. They're looking. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're they not. Yeah, they're 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 not. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was loud, bro. Yeah, big snort and then boop. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, well, maybe we'll give it a little bit of time and get across to those other ones. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, that was, that was pretty epic. That was, that was some of the coolest shit I've seen yet, bro. <laughs> I, um, yeah. That would have to be one of my highlights. Oh. Um. Oh yeah, I got some sick photos of you down there too. Oh, no. <laughs> so bro, uh, brief description of your, your stalk on that tar there. Oh yeah. Alright. So I started, where's my finger? Here we are. Started here. And old mate was Was he there? About there. Yeah, there. So just cat a game of cat and mouse came down here a bit. And then he disappeared over there so I motored down here and then he ended up being down here and I spoke to him and he just went <laughs> who yeah. knows how he clean jumped off that cliff it's pretty pretty crazy stuff yeah yeah mate that's loose
Yeah. So, we were um, break for lunch, and there was a there was a young tar turn up. So I had a crack at it, and um, and missed it, and then had another crack at it, and then that was even worse. So I'm having some doubts about my capabilities with a bow currently, which have been sort of niggling me all week because there's another tower up on the hill over here. But yeah, it's been niggling me all week <clears throat> that. I just haven't been shooting enough, and my uh, greatest fears came to fruition, as they usually do. So, there's going to be a bit of practicing going on at home before I go out for another hunt. Because um, it's downright embarrassing, to be honest. That light was a sitter. Uh, but fortunately, We've moved, it, we've moved up higher again and we're seeing reasonable numbers. So we are going to make a plan and get on with it and uh, hopefully get on to another animal. Watch Cam the Commando uh, apply himself to another stalk maybe. Yeah, so <laughs> you've seen what we've been doing. We uh, we're about to pack out at about five o'clock this morning. I uh, got up to go for a leak, and realistically, my body had probably done enough for this weekend. Her body said, "Knee guitar." Yeah, yeah, no more. Yeah, um, <laughs> probably it didn't it didn't make it to film last night, but we had a fairly tragic scramble down a very steep hill with lots of scrub and bush on it. Some things don't need to be seen. Nah. Nah, I uh, I lost a whole bunch of arrows coming down there, <laughs> so, so um, that's uh, definitely expedited my process of getting some new arrows and broadheads, and and to be honest, getting some practice in because I think uh, evident over the weekend that I need to lay off some things and, and get the target out and have a real good shoot at it. It's been a, a fucking mint weekend, bro. I've had like a cool adventure. And yeah, it's been great. Just to whip up into the been hills, it's been. Eye opening. Yeah. To be fair, it exceeded expectations. Oh, Coming yes, into a new spot, you just no idea. And a few people had said, "Oh no, it's a good spot. Look, plenty of animals, but yeah, bro. there's there's some meat running around these <laughs> yeah, hills. Yeah, 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 yeah. Far out. Yeah, yeah. S still the same amount of meat running around <laughs> these hills. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there is. It's um, uh, it's been cool, bro. And yeah, just an eye opening experience. I think. Uh, I think personally, I've got. Uh, a wee way to go before I uh, start pushing in for tar a bit more, but uh, it was cool. It was real cool. Oh, as we talked about, you come a long way in a short amount of time. <sighs> yeah. But tar hunting's no, no joke. It ain't no joke. It's bro. no joke at all. So. Yeah. Considering you, how long you've been hunting for? It's five months now. Five months. Yeah. Bro. Doing all right. <laughs> Doing all right. It's um. You bro, well, it's always a pleasure to come out with you, bro. Yeah, yeah. same here. Yeah, and I enjoy getting out with you, so. Yeah, it's me. Thank you so much for the invite this oh, week. Oh, good. We'll hit the spot again. Yeah. At some point. Yeah, I think there's um, there's pies at the local bakery Oof. and call maybe about Is an hour what? from now. Right, thank you, folks. I hope you enjoyed it. See you next time. Sweet team. We uh, missioned down uh, a couple of nights ago and walked in in the dark to uh, get to a little hut here. We were lucky enough to have that by ourselves, so that was pretty handy. Yeah, that's and, um, and yeah, but you can check out what we've been up to right now.
<laughs> Hit the record button. Ready? Yeah. <laughs>